When I moved here in 2011, obviously I was looking for a place to train. My friend invited me down here to the Ruka Training Centre to train with Jason Perillo. It's a very unique place, as you're going to see, and it has ties to surfing, skateboarding, and of course, mixed martial arts. We are at the Ruka headquarters. Let's take a look around. I guess let's get started with how and when Ruka started. Ruka started about 17 years ago in my garage. Right, wow. And that was... In Costa Mesa, California. Costa Mesa here? Yeah. Okay. So Ruka, RVCA, yes. is the balance of opposites. Correct. I've been training here for seven years. I still don't know what the balance of opposite means. Explain. Well, in a nutshell, the two chevrons carry the same weight. That's the like the V, three yep, vector yep. points as a chevron. And um, I was reading a lot of philosophy books, like Bruce Lee books, it's mixing these traditional sports or arts mm. together to make his own style. So I thought that was really cool because it wasn't segregating anyone. And so with Ruka, I just wanted to make, you know, like American workwear with a fashion twist. I know you're a black belt at jiu-jitsu, mm -hmm. and of course you have an amazing gym through there. Talk to me about how the Ruka brand yourself got involved with mixed martial arts, the whole combat side of things. It was started for BJ Penn when he was going for his first world championship belt for the UFC. There's a lot of distractions where he was, and uh, we were discussing about building a private gym for him to right. focus. And we had a lot of different fighters come in to help him for that fight. That was a long time ago when yes. you started the gym. Of course, now many champions have been through the doors. Talk about some of the people that have trained here. I mean, and... from Dominic Cruz to TJ Dillashaw, they've been through the door. So it's, it's yep. really nice to see just such high caliber athletes um, coming through and uh, doing their thing. And what's really special is um, there's been a few belts that have been won. So BJ went on to win two belts. Michael Bisbee won a belt training through the facility yep. for five, six years. Chris Cyborg, who they you know, sure. pretty much made a division for, and so she's a world champion training with Perillo out of there, and also um, Rafael Dos Anjos, he was a 155 champ, now he's at 170, now he's the number one contender. I mean, like, a lot of stuff's happened. If you could just write a book on what's going on in that gym, it's pretty amazing. As you can see, art and design is a big part of the Ruka brand. But even though I have a degree in fine art, I know more about punching people in the face. Let's go to the gym. All right, so here we are in the Ruka gym with the main man himself, Jason Perillo, my boxing coach, my head coach, my good friend, and of course, Tyron Woodley's next contender, <laughs> Rafael Dos Anjos. You know, we're in the Ruka place, but this is Jason Perillo's house. And this is, and I've been blessed enough where Pat makes yeah. sure that everybody knows that this is my house. So how did you end up down here? Yeah, I was, uh, when I left Kings, I was, you know, like, um, looking forward to improve my hands. A friend of mine brought me here to Jason, you know, and, you know, I've been having great results. One of the things that I like, and maybe you can talk about this, it's a very unique place, you know, and there's a, there's a special energy in here. I like to keep a, you know, obviously a relaxed atmosphere to where yeah. everybody can have a good time, everybody laughs in here, and, I, mm -hmm. and that's the pace and the, and the personality that I have. But at the same time, I'm able to connect with you fighters, guys that really know what they're doing, you yeah, know what yeah. I mean? And guys that really want it, and guys that are really hungry to win fights. You're down here, you're working with Jason. What do you like about working with Jason? Jason make me, you know, not about just technical stuff, yeah. but like mentally too, because fights is everything here. It's about the mind. Okay, Jason, as you know, I'm very deep and philosophical. Ruka, <laughs> the balance of opposites. That's what this place is all about. Do you feel that in here in the well, gym? Well, I mean, you got a little different people from all walks of life that are very popular in their worlds, you know, from yeah. artists, graffiti artists, uh, surfers, skateboarders. You know, he likes to bring a lot of the worlds together. He knows what talented people are attracted to other talented people. Mm -hmm. and he tries to bring different Most ways together. of life together, and, you know, it's pretty cool. It yeah, is. No, it's no, a really it cool is. thing. <laughs> As you can see, there's so much more going on here than a regular MMA gym. It really is a unique spot. We've shown you around, we've seen Rafael Dos Santos train. That's it, we're done. I hope you enjoyed the tour. I gotta train, get the hell out of here.